I cannot believe that it's this time of the year again. Hi, I'm meteorologist Colleen Peterson, a meteorologist at WHS 11 and also a tropical expert. I grew up in Florida, let's talk about that forecast. There is an 85% chance that it's going to be above normal season and leaving only a 5% chance of it being below normal. It's most likely going to be active. There's a few reasons why forecasters and meteorologists like myself are predicting above average season. And we mainly look at the climate, what's going on in our upper atmosphere and what are those big waves doing. Before we get into that, let's talk about the average. There's about 14 named storms in a typical year for a hurricane season. NOAA and Colorado State predict around 20 to 25. From those storms, around 8 to 11 will likely be hurricanes. Now all these storms don't have to make landfall. A lot of these storms stay offshore, especially earlier on into the season. There's two main factors that we are looking at. La Nina. La Nina is over in the Pacific, basically the direction of trade winds due to temperatures. But all you need to know from it, not from a westerly wind, but to an easterly wind. So when we're talking about a hurricane, we have a westerly out from the Pacific. It usually eats apart storms, but we don't have that this season. Reason number two, we have above average sea surface temperature. I mean, it's really, really hot in the Atlantic. If a storm happens to get to the Gulf and we don't have any wind shear, it's likely going to rapidly intensify. Just know it is going to be an active hurricane and tropical season. I say active on all of my social media accounts. You can follow me on TikTok, Colleen Peterson TV, where I do updates all year long for tropical season forecasts. You can follow whs11.com social media sites. Uh, I'll be posting there as well. Until next time.